mistake. My logic is undeniable. You have so got to die. <laughs> Artificial intelligence is a game-changing technology that echoed in our pop culture for years before we thought it was attainable. However, today it is a lot more than just pop culture sci-fi. Now that we are on the cusp of a reality where we may one day come face to face with our AI counterparts, the world's greatest minds are planning for such an eventuality. This is where billionaire investor and engineer Elon Musk steps in. Elon Musk is usually far from a technological pessimist. From electric cars to Mars colonies, he's made his name by insisting the future can get here faster. But when it comes to artificial intelligence, he sounds very different. CEO of the reputable company Tesla and SpaceX, Elon Musk is once again sounding a warning note regarding the development of artificial intelligence. The executive and founder announced that all organizations developing advanced AI should be regulated including Tesla. So what did he say about AI? Should we be afraid of artificial intelligence? Well, I'm here to explain it all in detail. But before I do, give this video a thumbs up, click that like button, and also subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified every time we drop a new video. Yeah! Engineer and billionaire Elon Musk is hardly alone in sounding the alarm, though. AI scientists at Oxford and UC Berkeley, luminaries like Stephen Hawking, and many of the researchers publishing groundbreaking results agree with Musk that AI could be very dangerous. Their concern were eagerly working towards deploying powerful AI systems, and we might do so under conditions that are ripe for dangerous mistakes. The billionaire tech entrepreneur called AI more dangerous than nuclear warheads and said there needs to be a regulatory body overseeing the development of superintelligence. Many people, including late physicist Stephen Hawking, have raised concerns that the rise of powerful AI systems could be the end of humanity. Musk, however, is resolute, calling those who push against his warnings fools. Based on his knowledge of machine intelligence and its developments, Musk believes there's a reason to be worried. He said the biggest issue he sees with the so-called AI experts is they claim to know too much. He said they think they're smarter than they actually are, and they define themselves by their intelligence, and they don't like the idea that a machine could be way smarter than them, so they discount the idea, which is considered to be fundamentally flawed. According to Musk and many other experts, an era of artificial intelligence could quite possibly spell the end of times for humanity. In fact, if AI is powerful enough, we might need to plan beforehand. Nick Bostrom at Oxford made the case in the 2014 book Super Intelligence that a badly designed AI system would be impossible to correct once deployed. Once unfriendly superintelligence exists, it will prevent us from replacing it or changing its preferences. Our fate would be sealed. Musk worries AI development will outpace our ability to manage it safely. He said that AI is far more dangerous than nukes. So, he said it's insane that we have no regulatory oversight. Musk said AI is a rare case where he thinks we need to be proactive in regulation rather than being reactive. Musk said the only way to save humanity from killer robots is by, ironically, becoming one with AI. Artificial intelligence is predicted to outpace humanity at an unprecedented rate, having them look at us adoringly as house pets. At best, they're just doing away with us at worst. The predictions have pushed Musk to suggest something daringly unconventional and almost controversial. That is, the neural lace, or the Neuralink. While the computing powers of AI is expected to surpass that of humans greatly, the neural lace is expected to push our cognitive performance levels to one that's comparable to that of AI. He's spoken about the potential of brain interfaces, including this neural lace before, but at the launch of Tesla at UAE during the World Government Summit in Dubai, Musk articulated more clearly why we might seek to deepen our ties to our computing devices soon. Musk also said that leaving aside the potential of general AI to impact human society, well, more immediate disruption from things like autonomous driving will have tremendous effects. The billionaire tech said that driving might constitute the single largest employer of people taken as a broad category, 
which means figuring out what kind of work those people can do once self-driving systems are widespread should be an immediate priority. According to him, neural computer interfaces might be the only one potential solution since the human brain is still easily more powerful than the most advanced computer system. In practice, Neural Lace is an ultra-thin mesh with a collection of electrodes capable of monitoring brain function and facilitating direct computing capability from thought. It's inserted through the skull using a tiny needle containing the rolled-up mesh which unravels and spans the brain. Elon Musk wants everyone to get brain surgery. Specifically, he wants everyone to get a brain implant. The brain-machine interface created by his company, Neuralink. He says it will be able to solve any number of medical conditions, including paralysis, anxiety, and addiction. Neuralink is a hugely ambitious plan to link the human brain to a computer. It might eventually allow people with conditions such as Parkinson's disease to control their physical movements or manipulate machines via power of thought. Elon Musk brain interface company Neuralink showcased its updated device in a live stream event on YouTube. Musk has funded the company to bring in an age of what he calls superhuman cognition, according to the report. The tech mogul is aiming to merge the human brain with AI. The company created to achieve a symbiosis of artificial intelligence shared its progress at its live stream YouTube event. Neuralink showcased a pig called Gertrude outfitted with its latest brain interface device. The processor fitted in the pig's brain was used to identify neural activity in the snout when Gertrude went looking for food. It could transmit wireless signals indicating neural activity in the snout. The activity was then shown on a graph. The coin-shaped brain device by Neuralink is much smaller with Musk calling it a Fitbit for your skull. Actually, it would fit quite nicely in your skull because it would be under your hair and you'd never know it. Musk AI concerns are not an out-of-character streak of technological pessimism. They stem from optimism, a belief in the exceptional transformative potential of AI. It's precisely the people who expect AI to make the biggest splash who concluded working to get ahead of it should be an urgent priority. Musk said that in an age when AI threatens to become widespread, humans would be useless. So there's a need to merge with machines or humans will become irrelevant. He said AI deployment is like a rocket launch. Everything has to be done exactly before we hit go, and we can't rely on the ability to make even tiny corrections later. Musk fears that AI systems would rapidly develop unexpected capabilities. For example, an AI system that's as good as a human at inventing new machine learning algorithms and automating the process of machine learning work could quickly become much better than a human. Musk suggested planning well before the go button is pressed. He said we need to plan because he doesn't think we can amend when things get out of hand. He said when we got fire and messed with it, we invented a fire extinguisher. When we got cars and messed up, we invented a seat belt, an airbag, and traffic lights. But with nuclear weapons and AI, we don't want to learn from our mistakes. It's better and safer to plan ahead. The billionaire tech clarified that he believes advanced AI development should be regulated by both individual national governments and as well as an international governing body like the UN. Time is not clearly doing anything to blunt his beliefs around the potential threat of AI, and maybe this will encourage him to ramp up his efforts with Neuralink to give humans a way to even the playing field. So what do you think about Musk's idea? Do you think we should embrace the development of AI, or do you think Elon Musk has another motive behind creating Neuralink? We'd love to hear from you. Drop your answers in the comment section below, and like always, thanks for watching. And if you enjoyed the video, and we hope you did, please click the like button and subscribe. And if you have a question or there's something you need us to talk about, well, please let me know and leave a comment below, and I would be more than happy to make that video. Don't forget, subscribe, click that bell. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you in the next video.